Hello YouTube, I have yet another product. This is a 6K, I call it for now just out of fun, bling bling keyboard. Uh, it is a macro keyboard, you can uh, change the keys, whatever, to, whatever you like. It has an OLED display and it has a gesture sensor, so you can wave over it and uh, it has of course NeoPixel backlighting for each key uh, it has two levels so this is actually a 12 key keyboard plus the gesture sensor which I have not implemented yet into the current code and it has also this is switching for the levels the for top and bottom level and it has also on off switch for the NeoPixels in case you do not want it or want to turn it off or whatever you like. Uh, these keys look great but they are fingerprint magnets. They're like crazy. Uh, I had some orange ones which uh, do look nice but somehow I, with the lighting you will see in a second it looks nice in bling bling style like I said okay now uh, this is based on the Atmega 32U4 which has uh, native USB support which you will see as soon as I plug it in you'll see the light coming on and you have the screen here showing what each key does since you cannot change the letters on the keys all the time so you have it on the OLED display so you will you will know what each key will do uh, as you can see here in the background now this is set for arrow keys and you see you just plug it in and it works you don't have to do anything you don't have to select it uh, could not find it so it just works uh, this is the delete button I have on here and this is the escape and I will change this and you can change them of course too when you flip the switch now it switched to the mouse keyboards you can use it as a mouse too and if I find the see the pointer here which is moving over here so you have a pointer up down left right and you have left key button and you have the right key button that you can choose left and right key so as I said you can change these around and uh, let me turn this light off here so you can see the colors the color switch also with the mode with the level let me put it this way of course you can change the colors to whatever you like in the code I will of course supply the code with it and I will also make other shortcuts for it and uh, have maybe different codes that you can just choose from what you like and then I can upload it and send it to you like that this will of course not be like this it will get a 3d printed enclosure and I will have it tilted slightly to the front so higher in the back it will not just lay flat so it will be tilted I have to design the keyboard uh, the 3d printed case for it I just finished this today this was a long time dream of mine I want to make this for a long time and I finally did it so this will be up on Tindy for sale and if you like you can get them there uh, I don't know how I'm gonna do this with the keycaps everybody has a different taste I will probably just offer some um, so you can choose what you like I also have these are brown switches I have red and blue also so I will put those as options also you can choose whatever key you like so this is it this is my macro 6 key 6 slash 12 macro keyboard 
Oh yes, and you can upload other code to it just using the Arduino IDE by selecting selecting the Leonardo board and uh, you just open the IDE, select the code, click upload, it uploads. As soon as it's finished as uploading, it turns into a keyboard again. So you don't have to unplug it, you don't have to select something, just very, very easy. I was surprised myself. Um, I think I covered all of it. Um, if something else, well, of course, I will make a video once I have the case ready. And uh, I will make the case maybe in silver or white transparent again. I don't know yet. Maybe offer options. But this is my keyboard. Anyway, I think I said only once today. So if you're interested, you can find it on Tindy. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments or get in touch with me via my contact button on the Tindy store. And uh, this is it. Thanks for watching and take care, everybody.